Hi, my name is Tim Houston. I'm a junior in the School of Kinesiology. I'm going to share a little bit of what my life is like here at the university and how I'm involved in research as an undergraduate student. I just left study group for my motor control class and I'm headed over to the undergraduate research opportunity program where I work as a peer advisor. I've got meetings with some students today and I'm going to see if some of them are willing to talk about what they do as student researchers here on campus. What do you gain from your research experience? I think one of the main things I gained is a really true sense of academic independence. Um, a lot of times we have independence when it comes to, you know, you come to college and everything is, is different, but uh, I met with my professor about one hour a week for the first semester. For the second semester, he was in New Zealand, so we Skyped once every couple of weeks. But for most of it, I was on my own, and that meant Seth, you know, he would say to me, Seth, in three, four weeks, I want, I want you to have this done and I want you to have these analysts and I would set my own timeline, my own times to come in and also a lot of times I'd have to determine how to do it. So we I've worked in this lab in the Europe program as a sophomore and ever since then I've worked just as a volunteer and our lab focuses on sensory motor development in young populations and particularly we've been uh, working on projects with infants who have myelomeningocele which is a congenital birth defect, affects the spinal cord and can um, cause problems with walking um, early on in life and even later in life. So what we're trying to do is develop some sort of intervention using treadmills um, to help infants step earlier in life and potentially um, keep them walking later on as they grow up. Charlie and I are going to do some kinesiology commentary uh, to research rock climbing, right? Yep. Yeah. See so the, uh, the force force tension. So you can see the, uh, yeah, the length, the, the way the force changes with the length of his muscles. Straight line arm pass there. Yep. Yeah. Good, good coordination. Some basic muscle activity going into the... Now we're over a thousand students are presenting their projects right now, things that they've been working on all year long. I was involved in a study on frailty and liver transplantation, and so I went into the clinics and I surveyed patients who were on the transplant list or were about to get a transplant, um, and I found out information like their physical strength and their quality of life, and we're compiling that data to see if we can um, improve post-transplant outcomes. What would you say you gained from your research experience? Um, for me personally, I gained experience working with patients. We have to go into clinics and actually have hands-on experience talking to people with diseases and their experience. I would tell an incoming freshman to definitely try research because it's something that you haven't experienced in high school or in anything else you've done. And it's definitely cool to try and it gives you a better idea of what you might want to do for a career because you can try something in the hospital, in a clinic, or you can try something in the lab and actually test out what you'd be doing for